Hi, welcome back to Buona Papa. Today we're going to prepare together a breakfast recipe with vegetables. We're going to prepare together spinach almond waffles. They are naturally gluten-free and grain-free. I really like the concept of adding vegetables and fruit every morning in my kids' breakfast. Not only because they are yummy and delicious, but because they give extra nutrients. Also, I noticed that if you add vegetables in sweet recipes, the kids don't even notice that you're eating vegetables, so mom is happy and the kids are happy too. This recipe is part of a series, Veggies at Breakfast, and if you want to check other recipes like this one, you can find them either in the link here below or in the link that should pop up here, up here. <laughs> All you need to do is simply place all the ingredients in a food processor, starting from the banana. And I really suggest you to use a very ripe banana because it will be very sweet. Then we are going to add half a cup of milk of your choice, two eggs, one cup of almond meal, one teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of baking soda, a quart of teaspoon of salt, three tablespoons of coconut oil, three tablespoons of maple syrup, but if you want to make this recipe without any added sugar, you can skip the maple syrup. At this point, it's even more important that the banana is ripe, because the sweetness of the waffles will come only from the banana. And last ingredient, the one that will give us that lovely green color, spinach. A nice bunch of baby spinach, fresh ones. Blend everything together into a super smooth cream and super simple, using a waffle maker, create your waffle. Follow the instructions on the machine. Usually you pour the waffle mix, you close the waffle machine, you wait three, four minutes up until the light turns on or off, depending on the machine. You open it and da -da, the waffle are done. If you do not have a waffle machine, don't worry. You can create instead of waffle, pancakes because the mix is basically the same. You can use a small pan, you can pour a few tablespoons of mix, you can cook them two, three minutes on one side, flip on the other side another one, two minutes, and your green spinach and almond pancakes at this point will be ready. It's totally up to you, so you don't need the waffle machine to enjoy this recipe. What if you have some waffle leftovers or pancake leftovers? Yes, you can freeze them. It's super simple. The only trick is to place a parchment paper foil in between waffles or pancakes so that once frozen, they will not stick, they will not attach. So it will be easier for you just to take out from the freezer only the quantity that you will enjoy. And how to tell them what I do is that I place for 30 seconds, the waffle in the microwave, so that basically they thaw inside, and then I place them one minute in the toaster, so that basically they get crunchy again outside. And in one minute and a half, my waffle are ready to be served. I really, really hope you're going to enjoy this recipe. If you want to leave me comments, check the area here below. If you want to check the ingredients list and the procedure, check the link to my blog in in the area here below and most important thing remember to subscribe to Buona Papa it's totally free and you will receive every single week a new recipe from me ciao ciao ciao